Like, are you serious? Out of all the places to sit in here, this is where you have to sit. And groom. We might be here for a while. Hello, I'm Dennis. I'm Andrew. We are the Crafty Lumberjacks, and welcome back to Handmade at Home. Yes, now if you're a cat owner, you know the struggle. Just keeping your cat entertained. It's so hard. Yes, Teddy is very particular about his playtime, his toys. He's needy. Yes, and he's yeah. been feeling a little bored lately, and honestly, we've been feeling a little bored lately. <laughs> yeah, so we thought, why not throw it back and make him his own whack-a-mole? But we're gonna be calling it Whack-a-Rat, because, well, New York. New York, yeah. <laughs> yeah, for obvious reasons. And we're gonna be using an old shipping box and turning it into a toy for Teddy. Let's get started. Okay, so what we're doing is taking a box, cutting it down into a smaller box. So yes. we need six pieces. That's one lucky cat. Yeah. <laughs> we want two pieces that are four by 12, two pieces that are three by 12, and two pieces for the sides that are four by three. And now we're just gonna cut holes for our toys to pop out of and for our levers. All right, now that we have our pieces cut, we're gonna move that out and start to cut our levers. For our levers, we're just gonna be using some scrap cardboard and cut them into strips. Now that our pieces are cut, we're just going to use a little bit of craft glue. Now you could use hot glue, but they probably won't stick together. And we're just gonna layer about four of them on top of each other. And we're making three levers. Of course, you can make as many levers as you want. We went with lucky number three. The levers are gonna rest on a dowel so they can move up and down. And we marked where the dowel is gonna go according to the holes in our box, just so the toy can pop up and down. We're just gonna be using a drill for this. If you don't have a drill, you could use a craft knife. And if you don't have a dowel, you could totally use a skewer or anything long. You just wanna make sure that your hole is bigger than your dowel just so it can move easily. Well, since this is whack a rat we need some rats. <laughs> yes, try saying that three times fast. whack a rat whack a rat I can't. We're gonna be making our rats out of cardboard, of course, and some string. Teddy's, uh, I think he's gonna love this. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna love it. I don't think but... he's gonna touch it. We thought it'd be fun to add a pop of color with a piece of felt. I'm going to hot glue the felt around the edge there, fold it over, and then I'm going to cut slits in the center holes so our mouses, our mice, our rats can pop up. Mouses. All right, now it's time to glue together our box. We're just gonna use a little hot glue on the edge and try to be really careful so it looks nice and clean. It's time to glue on our lever and there's a little bit of mechanics here. We wanna make sure that the dowel sits nice and straight and it's secure. So we're just adding a little bit of cardboard to the inner wall and then we're going to rest the dowel on that and then glue it down. Yes, we also wanna add some weight to our rats. Uh, so for that, we're using some pennies. You can use a washer, nuts, bolts, we whatever you have, have rocks. Yeah. All we have are the pennies. You wanna add that weight to the side that the rat is going to be in so that this way uh, it will fall into the hole and then the lever will push him out. Sounds right. <laughs> it's looking so cute. We're in love with it. Uh, before we glue down the dowel, we just wanna do a test. Just to make sure that everything's in place. It looks pretty good. I think the dowel's in a good position. All right. Let's All right, so now we're just gonna glue it right to the inner wall. And now we're just going to glue on our lid. And for our final step, we're just going to glue down our rats. This is almost too cute to be rats. I know. Little so field cute. mice or Actually, something. I think rats are pretty cute. I don't know. They are pretty cute. Rats are so cute. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay, I'm having a, a lot of fun with this already. <laughs> so cute. We'll let Teddy decide though. We really 
hope that Teddy's as entertained as I am right now. <laughs> yes. So, and also so we can get a break. Yeah, absolutely. So <laughs> let us know what your cat's favorite activity is. We would love some suggestions. Yes. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.